Well, tax season is officially underway, and you can expect many changes when filing. And joining us now is San Jose State Professor Carolyn Chen. So, Carolyn, let's break down this tax season uh, and, and the challenges that are facing a lot of people. So what's different about the 2022 return compared to 2021? So um, one of the unfortunate um, things that most people are going to be seeing for 2022 is that they'll be seeing a, a lower refund. And one of the reasons why is because the um, pandemic caused the government to increase um, many credits and it reduced the quali- uh, reduced the requirements to receive those credits. And so what's happened is now we go back to the original amounts pre-pandemic. So people are going to be seeing, uh, you know, lower refunds in that area. And let's also talk about student loan forgiveness. If part of your student loan is forgiven, is that taxable? Actually, no, that's not going to be taxable for federal and uh, for California. California has announced that they will not have any student uh, loan forgiveness taxable through the 2026 tax year. We do know a lot of people like to scramble to file right before the April deadline. I'm one of those people. So what do some last minute filers need to know? Well, for last minute filers, you actually have an extension of time here in California because of the floods that we have seen uh, over the past weeks. um, The uh, federal government has declared many counties in the state of California um, federal disaster areas. And the IRS has given Californians until May 15th to file. And California has also filed suit. So do you see a lot of people actually just waiting that extra month? (laughs) <laughs> Absolutely, Ryan, of course. Uh, I'll probably be in that um, group as well because, you know, most people really despise actually having to doing their taxes, but um, it is actually going to be nice to have that small extension. So um, given the fact that Californians have really suffered lately. Yeah, yeah, guilty as charged. I wish you didn't tell me because otherwise I would have got it done before April and, and now I'm going to wait just like everyone else. All right, Professor Carolyn Chen from San Jose State, thank you very much. Thank you.